Hello everyone, Ken and Loe here, back with more Half-Life 2 update on hard difficulty. And looking through the settings, uh, just as something fun to point out, is that I kind of forgot that this game has a virtual reality mode, so... <laughs> um, that would be interesting. But anyway, getting back to uh, where we left off, we just recently entered uh, City 17 again. We have some handy bombs for a few. <laughs> oh yes, we're gonna have some fun with these. Well, if I would actually hit them with them. Yeah, there we go. Come on, squad, we can do it! Oh. Yeah, some of these are actually very well placed. Oh no, you don't! Yes, resupply my one shotgun shell because I... <laughs> I always get shotguns! Because reasons. Well, the nice thing about these is that when they get... Oh, fuck. But with these, I don't think you really have that problem. Uh, can we go up here? I need it by any chance. Oh, that, that, that got me. Enterprise refusal to collaborate is simply a refusal to grow, an insistence on suicide, if you will. Did the lungfish refuse to breathe air? It did not. It crept forth boldly while its brethren remained in the blackest ocean abyss, with lidless eyes forever staring at the dark, ignorant and doomed despite their eternal vigilance. Would we model ourselves on the trilobite? Are all the accomplishments of humanity fated to be nothing more than a layer of broken plastic shards thinly strewn across a fossil bed, sandwiched between the Burgess Shale? Excuse yeah, that me. was enough of that. <laughs> I mean, many times I, I'm curious to see what Dr. Breen says on, on stuff like that, but his speeches are oftentimes really long, and I just... And as much as I want to listen to them, that would, um... That would take a while. We got company. So those big things, if I haven't mentioned it before, those are the big striders. They're essentially the tanks of the game. Well, it looks like this is uh, one way to go. Hello, can I get some assistance to move forward? I, I just have to ask, um, I met... We're at near the end of the game, and handgun bullets? Really? Handgun bullets. I saw you back there, head crab. Okay, that doesn't seem like a door that I can go through. Is there anything up here? No? Pardon me. I can stand on top of the door. I'm a ninja. Just got some soldiers in there. Nothing a few shotgun shells won't. won't 
fix for us? MG grenade. Hmm. That looks gruesome. Reload. Yeah, long range even the the SMG doesn't really work, does it? Do a flanking maneuver, gentlemen. I'll have him cor cornered in no time. Maybe I should be using the handgun at this point, just because I can actually kill stuff at this point. <laughs> well, I mean, the uh, I typically I typically don't use the uh, SMG all that much either. So there we go. Surprise! It's me. Oh, that's a handgun. I was about to say. Any more? No. We're making good progress, men. Let's continue on. See, I knew the shotgun would come in handy. Okay, there's a... I am reloading. <laughs> okay. Yeah, even though they're just policemen, they can be pretty uh pretty sneaky here.
Yes, using shotgun shells to destroy man hacks. Totally worth this it. Med kit. Thank you. So many people, it's kind of getting crowded. And I'm for once running low on shotgun shells. Take this med kit. Oh hey, just as we say I'm running low on shotgun shells. Ooh, that doesn't, uh, that, that doesn't look good. Um, can I have a med kit for, med, med kit for Sorry. the road, please? Here, have a med kit. This is bullshit. They're never gonna make a stalker out of me. Sometimes I dream about cheese. The cheese oh, man right deja here. Vu. <laughs> you and me both. Anything up here? Just the, uh... <laughs> the human eating wall. Lovely. Maybe I need to say that I'm running low on ammo on certain Sorry, guns. Freeman. Uh, more often because it seems like, oh, I'm running low on tracking shells. Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> Hack party. I gotta say, the gravity gun is amazing at killing these. Because with any other gun, I just completely miss. And it pretty much kills them and by smacking him to the ground. Satisfying at that. Okay, is there anything this way? Oh, there's my pulse rifle ammo. Oh, you guys can climb up too. I suppose not. It's a man hack. Handgun bullets. Oh, they actually blend in pretty, pretty well with the cat over there. Ah. I think I got him that time. There we go.
You got it, Doc. Oh, Doc. We're not fighting the police anymore. They've ramped it up or not. There we go. Stand back! It's gonna blow! You got it. Yeah, they're sending in... Sending in the military now again. Lead the way! Uh, sorry, Freeman. That door's locked from the other side, Dr. Freeman. Maybe you can find a way around. Yes, because uh, let's not have a... somehow not have a door handle on the other side. That makes sense. Um... Okay. Looks nasty in there. Good thing you've got that suit. That looks nasty to you? There's... there's... how... There's nothing there <laughs> that you can see from here. There's just road and then a truck. Serious? <laughs> Did you uh, scout in here first or something? Uh, okay, whatever. Okay, now it looks nasty, but <laughs> from that point of view, <laughs> really. Looks total. Looks totally normal. But with that, um, that's, this is where I'm going to leave uh, this part for now, after um, digging in to City, City 17 yet again, and trying to take back some crucial locations for the Rebels. So with that, thank you very much for watching, and have a wonderful day.